good morning and welcome back to our computer class today we are going to discuss about types of software license okay you all have observed that while downloading a software and installing a software you have to click on a box i agree okay and then the installation begin so what you are going to click on i agree you are going to click on i agree on the license that is your software license and all the terms and conditions are written the in that software license so today our topic is different types of software license so let us begin with your different types of software license before that we are going to learn what is copyright so copyright okay copyright what is copyright copyright whenever you are going to create your original work that work is copyrighted means you have created that work you are the originator of that work and you are having right that this sh work should be yours so that is your copyrighted okay the symbol for copyright is your c and that symbol uh, we have talked about creative commons the symbols used in your creative commons was your cc that is your copyrighted material but you are uh you can use that okay in your original way you can use that that is your copyrighted free material so that is your cc creative commons and now what is copyrighted material if anything जिसके ऊपर एक सिंबल लगा हुआ सी और एक सर्कल का दैट इज योर कॉपीराइटेड मटेरियल सो एज सुन एज यू आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट अवर कॉपीराइट अराइज ओके अ सॉफ्टवेयर कॉपीराइट प्रोटेक्ट्स ऑल सोर्स कोड सोर्स कोड मींस योर प्रोग्राम्स यू हैव मेड सम सॉफ्टवेयर यू हैव मेड सम प्रोग्राम फॉर एनीथिंग सो दैट इज योर कॉपीराइटेड सोर्स कोड then your written text material if you have written some notes about any other topic that is also copyrighted material or your graphics or your images or your original designs or your drawings or any link sound any music any video file or a film that is created by you is your copyrighted material okay so if the material is copyrighted then you are having five exclusive rights with that material and what are that five exclusive rights first is your fix or store the information in tangible form you can fix or you can store the information in tangible form you can reproduce a copyrighted material sell rent lease or distribute the copies of your copyrighted material publicly perform and display the copyrighted material then you are prepare derivative works based on copyrighted material It means you can derive something else from your copyrighted material so these are the five rights which comes with your copyright okay moving on to the next now what is license okay license license is a permission granted by owner or your holder of copyright to another a why they are giving you this permission to use their original work they are going to take some charge from you they are going to take some money from you for that license or maybe they are going to give you this license free of cost and if they are going to give you free of cost that software comes under your open source software okay so license what is license license is a permission granted by holder or your owner of copyright to another to use a original work now it is states under what circumstances and to what extent the original work can be used aisa nahi hai ki wo license material aapne le liya you can use it by your own name okay it may include a period of time ho sakta hai wo license aapko kuch period of time ke liye mila ho theek hai like your antivirus software okay ho sakta hai that software is 
यूज्ड इन सम जियोग्राफिकल एरिया साइट रिलेटेड हो वो हो सकता है उसके कुछ रिन्यूअल प्रोविजन्स हो मीन्स यू हैव टू रिन्यू आफ्टर सम टाइम्स और एनी अदर लिमिटेशंस और रेस्ट्रिक्शंस कैन कम विद द लाइसेंस एंड इट इज रिटर्न इन योर लीगल लैंग्वेज सो मूविंग ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट ना वॉट इज सॉफ्टवेयर लाइसेंस लाइसेंस means your software licensing के different types तो so, there are नाइन different types of software licensing first is your okay software licensing what is this yes you have to pay money for the license generally paid license now software license is a legal agreement about an application it's a legal it is between the software producer and the end user end user means the person who is using that okay so it specifies how application may be used and defines the rights of both producer and the user now different types of software license so the first type of software license is your proprietary license means your owner's license okay the second type of license is your gnu full form is your general public licenses this is generally your open source software means they are freely available to you gnu okay general public license the so while downloading any software if the software is with gnu you can download it then your end user license agreement is called the eula okay end user license agreement then the next is your work station licenses work station licenses uh, we will talk about that it is limited to number of machines like if you are going to use it on one machine or two machine it's okay if you are going to use it on any other device maybe it will your uh, the first installation will be deactivated so the next one is your concurrent use license this is a work station license you can use it for limited on the limited machines and concurrent use license you can use it on concurrent machines we will talk about that in detail then your site license okay this is particularly with your some geographical areas okay one site one site is having the license so all the computers in that site can use that software then perpetual license okay this is your uh, means one time paid software you have to pay for one time and you can use it for unlimited period okay then your non perpetual license means you are you have to renew that after expiry it will be your for limited time period like your uh, antivirus licenses are your non perpetual licenses okay the ninth type of license is your license with maintenance means they are giving you software also and they have charged you for the maintenance and that will be maintained means any updations are there they are going to update if any maintenance is required if any problem in the software they are going to repair that so these are the different nine types of license which comes with your software so now we will be talking about the one by one first is your proprietary license where the copyright stays with the producer and the user is granted the right to use the software okay you can use it but you cannot modify that okay the main uh, license is given by your owner and you can use that software like you are going to purchase any software like adobe software so proprietary license then your gnu that is general public licenses which are agreements under which open source 
सॉफ्टवेयर इज यूजली लाइसेंस और ये ओपन सोर्स को हम क्या बोलते हैं फॉस एफ ओ एस एस ठीक है फ्री ओपन सोर्स सॉफ्टवेयर फ्री ओपन सोर्स सॉफ्टवेयर ओके एफ ओ एस एस इट अलाउड यूजर टू चेंज द सोर्स को ओके लाइक स्क्रैच यू ऑल हैव यूज स्क्रैच स्क्रैच इज योर ओपन सोर्स सॉफ्टवेयर and you are going to remix the things you are going to create uh, your own code with the original code so that is uh, comes under your g and u but changed code to must also be made available under g and u aisa nahi ho sakta hai ki aapne code change kar liya and you are going to say now it is my copyrighted material and i am going to sell it no it's under your g and u gpl license okay next is your end user license agreement that is your eula which indicates the terms under which end user may use the software okay now this generally comes with your mobile apps like you cannot modify that mobile app you cannot give your name to that mobile app okay so this generally comes with your mobile apps license while installing any mobile app you just see the license name it will be your end user license agreement that is your eula okay next is your work station licenses are the licenses that permits the installation of an application on single computer this you have seen with uh, like you have purchased any book and book is having some online question papers so you can use that question papers only on one computer or on the second computer you cannot use it on many systems so before installing it on different machine the software must be removed from the first machine means it is your one machine one license okay you cannot copy it you cannot install it on any other computer also before installing you have to remove it first from the first computer moving on to the next concurrent use license now work station mein kya tha that is limited to one machine okay now concurrent concurrent means your concurrent permits the installation of software on to multiple machines it's not compulsory ki you have to install it on one computer okay or one machine as long as the number of computers using the software at the same time does not exceed the number of license purchased suppose you have purchased a license of 5 concurrent license they are having the permission to use it on 5 concurrent machine so you can use it on 5 but when you are going to use it on the 6 computer the license will be your dismiss okay moving on to the next site license now what is that site license site license permits the use of software on any computer at the specified site unlimited site licenses allows the installation of software on any number of computers as long as those computers are located at the specified site okay this generally comes with your uh, the softwares which are specially made for any one site okay like one company is having one software so all the computers must be installed that software one organization has designed their own software so that is your site license okay moving on to the next perpetual license okay comes without an expiry date like i am going to record it on the bandy cam the so bandy cam is a software which will allow you to record 10 minutes free and after that you have to purchase a software okay so if you are going to purchase it that will be your one time purchase so one time purchase means you are you are going to use perpetual license okay once you have to pay and you can use it for unlimited time नेक्स्ट इसी का अपोजिट है आपका नॉन परफेक्चुअल लाइसेंस एंटीवायरस सॉफ्टवेयर विच आर हैविंग द वन ईयर एक्सपायरी देन बिफोर एक्सपायरिंग इट विल बी गोइंग टू नोटिफाई यू 
renew your software renew your software okay and sometimes you are going to download the software it will be saying ki you have to pay this much money for 15 days after 15 days the another money will be deducted from your credit card so you have to remove the software from the computer if you want to cease paying the license fee agar aapko wo aage ki license fee pay nahi karna hai to you have to remove the software from your computer otherwise the fee will be deducted if once you have given the credit card number then license with maintenance last type of license offers maintenance or the software assurance along with the original license fee this also comes with your specialized softwares or your customized softwares which are specially made for any organization okay like your banks banks are using the software so they are going to use the software the license with maintenance like if any problem arises in the computer system their software they are going to maintain the system so these are the nine types of softwares which are comes under with your software license so now before downloading any software first see which type of license is there if gnu is there that is your open source you are free to download that if any other type of software then first read the instructions and do that okay goodbye for now stay safe stay at home goodbye